<laughs> oh god. <laughs> that one was really fast. Like as soon as I stepped on a thing, it scared the crap out of me. Alright guys, I'm over in Belden Village here in Canton and I'm gonna go in here and check out the party city and see what I got for Halloween. And right on the front, I got a huge sign that says, Halloween, it's alive. Yeah, look at that. Halloween, it's alive. Hello, kitty. <laughs> All right, wait, what do we got here? We got some black cauldrons right out front. Trick or treat buckets. Look, a pink one. That's kind of funny. Pink Halloween bucket. Wonder if these all got the same, yeah, probably the same uh, face on all of them. Here's a boo bucket. Look, there's even, oh, I thought there was a boo inside, but it's on the other side. This is clear, it looks like it, though. A couple of witches here. All right, let's go on inside. All right. Lots of stuff in here, guys. The Stranger Things costumes crack me up, because, look, it's just like basic clothes you could find anywhere. We got some hanging skeletons and ghouls and witches and killer clowns. Everybody's trying to make their clowns look like it now, Pennywise. <laughs> All right, let's see, we got some headstones over here. Somebody had just told me the other day to keep an eye out for Nightmare Before Christmas stuff. And I see it everywhere. I mean, I don't know what good it's gonna do them unless, of course, it's uh, in their area. But look, we got the... Uh, the sewer grabber, like from over there at Halloween City, and I, I'm pretty sure that Party City is part of Halloween City. Rattling Grave Buster. Oh look, we got the Aragni Sautus. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. <laughs> Jumping Spider. Oh, Forgotten Toys. I haven't seen that one anywhere. That's pretty cool. All right, wait a minute. What's making sound? Oh, it's the Jumping Spider. Let's see if he'll jump at us. Come on now. Oh, God. oh my god, it never fails, guys. That thing just scared the living crap out of me. Look at it. It's white, too. It's white and furry. Hello, Mr. Spider. He scared me so bad. All right, let's check this one out. I have no idea what's about to happen. Is that it? All right, apparently he doesn't jump or anything. But here is the sewer grabber, like we saw um, in the Halloween City one. Let's check this out. Okay, look, his eyes light up. Watch this. Okay, here comes. He never jumped at me. His arm is supposed to come shooting out of there and it scares the crap out of me every time. Here's some other ones here. There were some girls over here turning them on, trying to scare me. This one here is apparently Lonely Laura, which scares me already. All right. That's pretty creepy. Look at her legs going. <laughs> I like when the eyes light up like that on these things. That's pretty creepy. All right, now we got a witch over here. I don't know if she jumps, but I heard a noise when these girls were messing with it. Oh, God. <laughs> that one was really fast. Like, as soon as I stepped on a thing, it scared the crap out of me. All right, guys, that one, wait, let's zoom in. That one is Haunting Harriet. That scared the living crap out of me. Let's do it again. As soon as you step on this thing, it jumps up. Watch. <laughs> All right, look, we got the toys here too. This one is the forgotten toys from right here, but it must just be like motion activated because I don't see anything to step on. I don't know how to get it going though. It was just moving a minute ago. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> No, thank you. 
Okay, definitely creepy, but it wasn't uh, like a jump and grab. All right, let's keep looking. I don't know if there's any more of these uh, animatronics in here, but if there are, we're gonna find them. There's a ton of stuff though. Okay, let's see. We got like the black lights. What is that one up there? Oh, that's... Yellow. Coven. Glowing faces with haunting music. I don't see that one. Oh, wait, yeah, I do. It's the very first thing. I walked right past it. How stupid of me. Looks like they're... They must be motion activated, but they're not doing anything. I hear them making sounds, and I can see that there's lights right here. So maybe it just has to be dark for those to actually light up for you to be able to see them. Okay, anyways, let's keep on looking around here. I bought a black light yesterday from, I think it was Spirit. Here's an inflatable Nightmare Before Christmas, Jack Skellington. Oh, he's got his pup with him. Okay, this is a long black light, man. Okay, oh, look at this. Evil pumpkin. That looks pretty cool. It's got a little light inside. Probably flickers. A couple of pretty cool inflatables here. Look at this one. Ghost stories. <laughs> when I first came in here, I just expected to see like a really small Halloween section, but look at this. I mean, the whole place is like decked out with stuff. We're gonna check it all out. Skulls and skeletons, life-size skeleton here. 25 bucks, that's about the price I've been seeing them everywhere. At least that style, there's lots of different life-size skeletons. In fact, here's another one right here. Posable. All right, let's see. Table covers, party stuff, eyeballs. <laughs> what is this? Oh, a haunted tree man, look, it's a face. You stick that on the tree like that, that's pretty cool. This one is, it feels like a real thin plastic though. You wanna get like the better quality ones. And look, they got stuff for like a it party. If you wanna have like a bloody tablecloths and stuff. Look, this one has uh, hand marks. That reminds me, <laughs> that reminds me of the bathroom at the abandoned Walmart at Garfield Heights. <laughs> Kevin was here, I think that's what it said. All right, let's see what else we got here. Look, we got a head on a rope, guys. And a, uh, a clown head on a hook. I know what you did last summer. Giant steak long lawn hands. Look, look how big they are compared to my hands. <laughs> and here's that Nightmare Before Christmas stuff. All kinds. Look, there's a mask here. That's a nice one. That's, that's a fabric mask. Let me pop it out a minute. There we go. That looks better. That's a pretty nice one. That looks better than the rubber ones. $70 for that, guys. The mouth moves with your mouth. Here's a cheap plastic one if you don't want to spring 70 bucks. That's only 17. There's a costume there. Oh, look at this. A blow up one, seven feet tall. Nightmare Before Christmas tree skirt. I like this. Ooh, there's a try me button. Andy didn't do anything. Oh, I see. You just press it and he lights up. That's pretty cool. I like it. Okay, this is something I haven't seen anywhere else. Instead of actually getting the costumes and putting them out, look, they have an entire wall of just like magazine pages, basically. Giant magazine pages you can look on here and choose what you want and then go tell them what you want. All the way down, they got tons of them. I mean, I can see why that makes it practical, but I don't know. I kind of like looking at the stuff. Look, we got Chucky. <laughs> oh my God, I love this mask. I saw this in the Halloween city the other day. It's just an old man with a bingo hat. I love bingo. How funny is that? What's this one here? Stanley, Stanley, I don't know what that is, but okay. 
Here's a bunch of masks. I don't really understand this one. Serial killer mask. And they have his mouth like sewn shut. I don't really get that. I mean, I said in the... What is it? The silencer. Okay, so that girl over there just told me this is the silencer. I'm gonna have to look that one up. All right, let's see. Yeah, look at that, how weird is that? We got some costumes out here. Masks. Here's the Jason Voorhees deluxe, deluxe mask. The Delusk Max. Look, here's the old, I can't even talk. It movie, this is the original Pennywise mask. That's really not too bad. And here's the new one. Not too shabby. Oh, here's the Pennywise wig that I saw in the Halloween City the other day. I don't know if I've seen this one anywhere. This is from the Scream series they did on MTV. I don't really care too much for that mask. I like the original. Kids masks. There's a handful over here. A chicken. Supreme chicken, that's called. Of course you got Trump. Comb over leader mask. It's funny how they tiptoe around the copyright things. Oh crap. I always drop something. <laughs> All right, guys, look at this. Look what I just found. This, eh, I don't know. It's all right, it's different. It's not my favorite ever. But it is It is one that I haven't seen anywhere else. Blender Man. Here's that one we saw the other day. I like how thick that is, but I just don't like how it's not a full mask. Then we got this one down here I haven't seen anywhere with the rubber hair. Why are they all smashed? I swear somebody goes around and just punches all the masks in the face. <laughs> all right, let's move on here a little bit and see. All right, this would be like the scream mat or the uh, the scream knives. Here's an even better one. That's kind of cool. Okay. Ooh, look at these guys up here waiting to haunt us. <laughs> All right, let's go see if there's anything down this way that we missed. It looks like basic costume accessories down this way. What the heck? <laughs> Mr. Potato Head costume. I like that. All right. Hip boy. I'm not a big video game person, a gamer, so I don't know what that is, but maybe some of you do. That looks pretty cool, though. Look at the gun. Gears of War, I think that's from Halo. I got some pretty cool stuff here, actually. All right, let's keep jamming down this way. We got Harry Potter stuff. I like it. I want to be Harry Potter. Okay, let's see. We got these hanging ghosts and ghoulies. Clowns. Here's a, uh, oh, look, zero. Oh my God, that is awesome. I love it. That is so cool. <laughs> I haven't seen that anywhere. It's staked prop. So apparently you put this stake together and you stick them in the ground beside one of these. This trusty companion. I love that. That is so cool. Look at this, guys. We got more uh, party favors and stuff. This is the kind of stuff that actually gets me excited about Halloween. Because I love like the fun party favors and things like that. Look, eyes, sprinkles, white, orange, and black. Halloween is so much fun. Look, I love how they have like the big ghouls haunting each aisle. <laughs> okay, let's go down here and do this one first because it looks like there's a couple of Halloween costumes and stuff down here yet. And then we got a whole aisle on the other side. Oh my God, look at this. <laughs> Leg warmers. They look like Chewbacca. Holy crap. Viking hat, look at that. I would totally wear that. I should buy that and wear it in a video. Just not ever say a word, just wear it around. <laughs> Katy Perry. No, I'm just kidding. I do like this stuff though, that's cool. Look at this mask. Pretty cool. I wore a toga one year to work. I was a nurse and I wore a toga to work. 
adult size diapers and baby kits. Police uniforms, doctors, nurses. Look, we got a sugar skull up here. That's a pretty cool mask, actually. I'm not the kind of person to ever just wear a mask for Halloween. I mean, I would just go all out if I were gonna dress up. But some masks are pretty cool. All right, let's keep moving here. Oh, look, we got the greaser, Sandy and Danny, without the copyrights. Wait, here it is with the copyrights. <laughs> oh my God. Zombie stuff, circus. Here's all your clowns. Pimps. LL Cool J. <laughs> we got some evil axes. Oh, look at this skull. That's pretty cool. You know what kind of costume you'd use that with? Mad Max or something? Ninjas, double swords. You know, one, one costume I'm really surprised I've never seen anywhere. I mean, at all, even when the movie was popular, is kick-ass. Like, why did we never see a kick-ass costume? But here's a kick-ass Freddy mask. Oh my god. That is actually a pretty decent-looking Freddy. It's really tough for people to get the Freddy masks right, but that one is really good-looking. And it's only 30 bucks. This is actually from the Rob Zombie version of Halloween, which I hated. I did not like those at all, man. Okay, let's get away from those. Got one more aisle here that we can go down. Haunted by the Skeleton King, Queen, whatever it is, I don't know. What's this, Nightmare Before Coffee? Oh my God. <laughs> okay, yeah, this just looks like basic uh, costume accessories, wigs over here. Oh look, Joker. That would be the Joaquin Phoenix Joker, I think. Because it certainly doesn't look like uh, Heath Ledger. And this is super lame. Batman, Superman. I'm not wearing hockey pads. Does he say hockey pads or hockey pants? I could never tell. We got all kinds of hats here. Here's a burger hat, a chicken hat. A poop head hat. I wonder how much longer the poop emoji thing is going to be a thing. I'm about tired of that. All kinds of hats, though. Oh, look, we got a shark. This is a pretty decent looking scarecrow hat. Uh, yeah. If I was going to dress up as a scarecrow, I would totally wear that. We got a few Star Wars things here. And here's a chewy mask. That's not too bad looking for a plastic mask. Tutus. <laughs> Leggings. Yeah, just all kinds of costume accessories. They got a lot of stuff in here. A lot more than I expected to see when I walked in the door. Oh my god, guys, look at this. Antlers, mythical creatures. How would you make them stick to your head? What in the world? Okay, look at this over here. <laughs> There's people getting scared by these things over here, I swear. I'm just about to camp out in the aisle and film people getting scared. Whoa, look at this. The, what is this called? Venetian rabbit mask. All right, I just wanna look at one more thing quick here. The, uh, damn it. That stupid spider again. When you walk by, he's motion activated and you can hear him start to make sounds. So I knew he was going to jump. But what I wanted to look at here is this rattling grave buster. Because I think he is supposed to like bust up or at least it's supposed to jump at you or something. But this is him right here. And unless he's just... Yeah, it's supposed to jump up like this. And it just doesn't do that. He makes a lot of sound. See if he'll do it now. Yeah, he's supposed to jump up at you and he's not doing it. And uh, Pennywise's arm is supposed to shoot out at you. Oh look, we got these little things up here making sounds. That's pretty creepy. 
Oh, and I didn't do the uh, the door knocker here. guys yeah I really like that not the best looking Pennywise I've ever seen but pretty cool nonetheless all right let's get out of here I think we've seen it all thank you party city for an awesome Halloween time I always get scared with these animatronics even though I know it's coming but I think I jumped higher at some of the ones in there than I have at even like the giant uh, clowns over at spirit <laughs> <laughs>